Meghan Markle is seeking control when it comes to how her kids are raised. This is despite Prince Archie and Princess Lilibet Diana being titled, Blood Royals who deserve to know the rest of their family. This led royal historian Hugo Vickers to tell The Sun, I think the problem for the children, as I see it, is that yes, they're probably having a very nice time being brought up in California. I'm sure it's a lovely place to be brought up. But there's going to come a point when they realize that they are actually cousins to the British royal family, and that they could have taken part in all the sort of things that Prince William's children take part in, he added. And you know they don't, even, as far as I can see, no, they're cousins at all, and that surely must be quite tricky and disappointing really, for them. The expert also highlighted how Prince Harry and Meghan are struggling to stay ahead in the high-energy, competitive world of Hollywood. Obviously, they had quite a good time at the beginning, he added. But the trouble is, it is this high-energy, competitive world in which they now exist which is very, very hard to deal with. And I'm sure she's had a certain amount of experience of this. I'm not sure how much experience Prince Harry had of it. This led a commenter on X to share how the pair aren't built for Hollywood mentally. They do not have what it takes to face near constant rejection and ridicule just to finally get a break, they then have to defend and maintain relentlessly. That's what Hollywood is. Additionally, Vickers chimed in on the Duchess' difficult controversy surrounding the former Suits star. The author stated that the new nickname fits the Royal Rebel, thanks in part to how she treated Crown staff during her 22-month stint as a working royal. The Queen didn't like people being rude to staff, he continued. I'm sure that it's one of those situations where, probably, when things are going well they're very generous. And they remember their birthdays, and they send them little gifts and all that sort of stuff, but the moment things get stressful, that's when you see the true side. He further observed, I'm afraid I rather veer on the side of thinking that she's difficult, and it's not a good sign if you can't be good with your staff, you know you're in trouble. The Duchess came under fire after sources told The Hollywood Reporter in a September 12th story that she had left some of her staff reduced to tears thanks to her work-related rampages as a former Kensington Palace staffer once called the Meltdowns.